Hi, and welcome to Hard Talks. So in this video, I'm going to talk about uh, this movie here, The Slumber Party Massacre. I watched it the other night and I said to myself, I need to, <laughs> I need to do a quick little review of this film. So basically, this uh, movie is about a escape killer who uh, goes to a uh, go to a slumber party to kill women, <laughs> basically. So uh, I will have to say that this is a great slasher. The killer was sadistic. He was creepy, and he definitely killed very effectively with his drill. The other characters, uh, they were they were likable. They were likable. They were relatable. Uh, the story itself. Now, some say the story in the setting, it mirrored Halloween, uh, the 1978 edition. I, in, in some sense. I can agree, but I will have to say that the Slum Party Massacre, uh, the story is, it's its own story, in a way. It's not a, like a total copy of Halloween. It's its own story. It's, it is a good slasher. I will have to say that. The killer, he had the potential to be a uh, Michael Myers or uh, Jason Voorhees. You know, iconic in those kind of, in that kind of role. He, yeah, he definitely was a good kill, a good killer. I, it actually, I should do another video of the guy who played, who played the killer because he he took it seriously because he was a method actor and it shows in the film. Um, what else can I say? Uh, it had its comedic moments, but it was a slasher through and through. Um, I don't, I don't know. This is, I can talk about this movie all day, probably, <laughs> but I will have to say that if you are a horror fan, buy this and add it to your collection. It is, you know, it's definitely is underrated, and you know, it's, it's too bad. It, I guess it did have some kind of a notoriety, but I've, ne I've never heard of it, honestly, until, until months ago. But anyway, this film is good. Buy it, add it to your collection, you won't be disappointed. And with that said, uh, this is Hard Talks. Thank you for watching, and uh, have a good day, or a good night.